Hi, uh, sorry, it's super dark here. Um, but I'm kind of like lighting some candle here. I got this one is the one that I got from Victoria's Secret. Um, I just got some of it um, for the um, semi-annual sale. I mean, it's actually from Bath and Body Works. Sorry about that. Maybe I probably switch up the lighting for a little bit. Um, since the lighting here is super bad. Let's try this one. I think I like this one a little bit better. All the lighting like this. It's probably better like this. Like you would be able to see my face better. Uh, I don't know what the candle is doing. Maybe I just turn it off. <sighs> okay, never mind. I just turn it off. I just don't think it's necessary for the candle to be lighting. And for some reason, it's melting. Like something really like waxy. Um, It's very waxy. For some reason, something is melting. I don't know what the hell is it. So anyway... Um, let's go ahead and jump into it. Like, I got a haul video today. I went to the mall with my friend, um, too, and, um, uh, we did got so much stuff. Um, I'm wearing my pink college collection again. I love this jacket. Um, I think they still have some of it at the store, but, like, it just, like, uh, vary from the location. So, anyway, let's, without further to do, let's go ahead and jump in. Uh... I think um, I'm gonna start with everybody's favorite store. Um, I got a big bag from Pink. So big! The first thing I got is this very. I don't know where did the lady leave the receipt. I'll try and look for it. The first thing I got is this really nice and comfy robe. It's like this sequence kind of material. It's so freaking gorgeous. Look at this. It's just like pink on the back. And it's just a robe. Like there's really nothing that I can actually explain. But it's really cool. It has like these sequins going on. Like when I first look at it, I'm just like, wow. It is so beautiful. I just don't know if it's like comfortable. I mean, I don't know. It's just like, I mean, even though it's super cute, but like, I'm just not sure if this is comfortable. And it's in the size extra small, small. The, to the original price is um, $54.95 and I got it for $34.99. Which is like, not like the best deal that you ever get from the semi-annual sale. But like, man, I just really want another robe. Well, I actually got two robes. Because the store that I went to, somehow they got so many robes that you just like, wow, it's incredible, crazy. And then I just got a pair of underwear. This is just a boy short. But I thought it was so cute that I just cannot pass through it. It like, this is the front and this is the back. And the back is said, world greatest rappers. This is the back. Like, come on, you cannot... So this, I think this is more like a hipster, or like a boy short. I think it's more like a hipster, but like you know, like these are like really great to wear when you feel like shit. You know, like you're just like okay, you know, I don't care about other people thinking about what the hell am I wearing under, so I'm just gonna wear this just to be comfortable. So that's the second one that I got. I should just put it away. It just doesn't look cute to show your underwear and just leave them there, you know. And then I got one of these coupon. I'm gonna cover this because I'm gonna use it. Um, it's like a twenty percent off, um, you know, a full price item. And then this is also from Pink. I just have so many, so I have to put it in a different bag. So this is another roll. You can tell I am very obsessed with roll. Like, I have a, a big obsession with robe. My husband said, like, you're so crazy about robe. You have so many. I know. I have so many. And then this one also have a hood. Like, I love something that have a hood. It's like a polka dot kind of, like, thing. I don't know. Polka dot used to be a thing back then, huh? I don't know. And it's like a... And it's on the back. It's just, like, on the sides, it's, like, pink. I don't know if you can even see it. And then it's have a hood. 
and I just have the thing to hang it in and of course it have a little what is that called string to like tie it around your waist and this one is also in the size extra small small original is fifty four ninety five and it's a kind of like the same original price with the other one and this one a little cheaper it's actually twenty five ninety nine I don't know if you can even see that I actually ripped the tag so it's twenty five ninety nine so that's pretty cool it's a little cheaper this one look a little bit more comfortable I can tell um but I got the other one anyway just sometimes I feel like a little bit more fancier going on <laughs> you know and then I went to the one I have an exchange so this is just an exchange item oh yeah I got the receipt for this one here okay yeah that's right cool Total was like $71 or something like that. So I got this one. Forever 21 have like 50% of all. A lot of the sweater. This one is one of them. I would like to try this one out. Uh, maybe I can try it at the end of the video or something. Uh, maybe I can try it out. Just uh, i probably try it out and come back. Just give me one set. Alright guys, this is how it look. It's actually really nice. Like, it's like kind of cover my waist already so it's pretty cool it's actually in the side medium um very like how do i say like it's very like flowy i'm kind of glad that i actually got this in the side medium because it's a little bit too short it's more like a crop sorry i have a lot of extra things going on right here um yeah so got a glass i actually got it in the side medium it's super long right here though and this one was like eight dollar yeah it's so crazy, this is only $8. I mean, like, everything in there was, like, freaking 50% off. Like, I'm like, wow, Forever 21 and Tide try to get rid of all this stuff. You know, like, original is, like, 18 17 95 or some stuff like that. I don't remember. It's, like, the original price is, yeah, I'm pretty sure this original price is seventeen fifty. I still have a tech, if you can see. It's seventeen ninety right there, so I medium. So this is pretty cool. I mean, I love the color. It's just a little bit long, so you might have to like fold it up, but like it's not a big deal. So yeah, I guess I'm loving this thing. I mean, it's not. It's a little bit short because it's a crop, but I still liking it. And then the last store I went to is oh my god, this is so annoying. The last store I went to is Riley Rose. Riley Rose is actually like a new store um, in my mall. The bag is actually super cute. It just said Riley Rose right there. And the only thing that I... Everything that is, is kind of expensive. Like, I'm like, wow. I thought like, it's like... I think it's half exactly the same receipt as Forever 21. And you know like how in the Forever 21 website, the next website next to it is actually Riley Rose. So I'm thinking the same owner is actually own Riley Rose. And they actually have like product like from BH Cosmetic, Winky Lux, um, um, what's that called? Winky Lux, BH, um, a bunch of Korean store. Like Korean product like, hold on, let me show you guys. I have been hurting about this product for such a long time, but I didn't want to order from Amazon because, you know, I didn't want to spend the, the shipping fee. So when I saw this, I'm just like, yes, here's the time. This is the Cleanest Zero. It's like a cleansing balm for remove your makeup. It's kind of remind me of the Clinique take the day off cleansing balm, except that one is $29 and this one is $21. So the bottle is big. Wait, if I can open this. My husband actually took my Caesar. And now everything is so hard to open with our Caesar. Okay, so when you open it, it's come with like a little, like what do you call this? Like a spoon or something? It's come with a little spoon. So you can like scoop it out. Actually, that's cool. That's I actually appreciate that. Uh, and this is the product. It looks like this. It's called Cleanest Zero. I actually 
read a lot. This is actually a Korean brand. They have a bunch of Korean words that I do not understand. I'm actually Vietnamese, by the way. I don't understand uh, Korean. That's a big difference in language between Vietnamese and Korean. So even though I do look Korean, but I do not. I'm not Korean. I do not understand whatever Korean say. So yes, of course. But I do understand English pretty well. Um, I mean, there's a lot of people. You know, start judging you and be like, "Oh, you look Asian. You don't even speak English well." I'm like, "No, excuse you. I do speak English. You just don't know what you're saying. I actually speak better language, two language better than you. You don't only speak English. I speak Vietnamese and I speak English. I actually learning Spanish too. So it's like, okay, you know what? I actually learned the third language. I'm actually better than you. But you know, people just really don't know how to control their behavior, especially when they get angry." They talk wherever they want to, you know, like they act ghetto, you know. That's actually the difference between the people here and the people in my country. The people in my country, when they mad, they know how to control their whatever, you know, like behavior going on. They they know how to control it. They don't talk like ghetto. They don't start being ghetto, you know, be like ah, like this and like that. The people in my country is actually completely different. The people here, when they mad, they completely out of it. They just, you know, talk thing. And later they become so regret because because they talk shit to other you know and they come back they they um apologize but like I said you know there's no point to apologize when you be rude with to other and come back and apologize just just might as well just don't say it you know why you say it and then you come back and you apologize like really so you know it just it just a lot of different going on between the culture but um but you know like when I'm mad. I try to keep things down, you know, because I don't want to hurt others, or I, I don't want others to hurt me. That like, I don't want to hurt others. I don't want to say things that gonna hurt people, you know. Even though I'll apologize, but they will remember. I'm telling you, they remember it. Well, anyway, it's just a little bit out of the hall. But this is the Clinic Zero. It's come from Korea, and I want to show you real quick what it's like inside. Of course, it's actually have the little what's that called? protector like you know when you first buy a product but uh, it's like a bond so it just remove your makeup so yeah that is all i have for the haul you you guys um i'm a little bit out of it today <laughs> um so yeah thank you for watching and i'm probably gonna have the third part of the victoria's secret semi-annual sale come up pretty soon because i did order something online but it's pretty busy right now since New Year time, so they probably take a little bit of time for them to um, processing my order and deliver it to me. So yeah, just go ahead and just, you know, do whatever you need, and then I'll probably be back for the third part of the semi-annual sale from Victoria's Secret. Anyway, see you guys. Um, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Subscribe. Thank you.